Okay, here we are on the Coors job. Uh, this is the carport uh, right here, this area right here. It will be a step, a door that goes into the garage. Uh, this is the garage area right over here. Uh, parking area, nice 18 foot uh, wide door. Um, storage area, curb stop. This area is in the garage up to about where this line is right here where the insulation is under the concrete. It's your mechanical area over there. Um, come into the house. Uh, this is a guest room right here. Front entry to the home is right over here. Uh, this is the kitchen, uh, dining room, and the great room area. So you come through the uh, great room area. Front door opens up onto the entry portal. Nice colored stamped concrete. That's uh, really pretty stamped. The color is Omaha tan. Uh, the views are going to be due east, uh, right towards the mountains. Um, this patio over here is the master portal. And you can see what we do, we key lock the colored concrete into the heated area foundation so that no matter how my door ultimately sits in here, the color will go underneath the door threshold and there will be no gaps or cracks or color change or any other issues like that. Uh, it'll be nice and clean and, and look good, look like it should look. Uh, these are zero clearance thresholds here on the front of the house so that um, it's a universal design principle. There's no step, there's no threshold apart from the threshold of the door. Um, this is the master bedroom, then the master bathroom uh, area, master closet back in the corner. Uh, depressed shower pan here again there'll be a zero clearance uh, threshold going down into the shower uh, then the back patio uh, right here and it is uncovered so we did do steps on the back patio um, just another uh, uh, way to, to, to protect against any potential water infiltration or issues with the water on the back doors so this uh, pad came out really really nice Today is the day before Christmas Eve, so we will actually begin framing here next Tuesday. Um, stay tuned. Thanks for watching.